Well, this picture behind me is what Erica Baker would look like if she were still alive today. She would be 24 years old. This photo was released by the National Center for Exploited and Missing Children today. As her loved ones gather to remember her, they tell me that they're not giving up hope that one day she will come home. Please keep looking. She's not home. A mother's plea 14 years after her daughter disappeared. I'm not at peace. Nine year old Erica Baker was walking her dog at a park near Kettering Rec Center in 1999 when she disappeared. Christian Gabriel said he hit and killed Erica and buried her body, but he couldn't remember where. Gabriel served six years in prison for gross abuse of a corpse and tampering with evidence. Her body has never been found. Erica's parents decided it was finally time to dedicate a monument in their daughter's honor today at David's Cemetery in Kettering. This was mainly for the community and my family and her friends. And the only thing that I can say is thank you so much for everything that has happened and, and, and the caring and the giving. And, you know, a lot of the donations helped get this stone put in place, you know. And without you guys, there's really nothing that we can do. I mean, it, 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 it took an entire community and abroad to make everything happen today. And many of those community members came to today's memorial to show their support for her family, writing messages to Erica. Mary Lou Smith was Kettering's mayor at the time of the little girl's disappearance. She says that day will live with her forever. I always remember it as one of the worst nights of my life because I sat up there uh, in the park and watched our people down in the, in the pool searching in the, in the water looking for her. And Erica's mother says she will never stop searching until her daughter is found. I'm not ready for this emotionally to let go, say goodbye, because I don't have proof of anything. Of course, if you have any information on Erica's disappearance, call Crime Stoppers at 222-7867. Police tell us they are still checking out every lead they receive. Reporting live, Jackie Sprague, 2 News, working for you.